Good morning, YouTube. Today is uh, Monday, no, Friday. Friday, August the 23rd, 2019. And uh, I've been asked by a couple people to give an update on my Podocarpus uh, Phoenix graft. That this is a Podocarpus tree that I, uh, I styled with um, Eric Weigert at one of his workshops several years ago and it was my favorite tree and somehow I killed it and I kept the trunk dead trunk for a couple of years I liked it so much because of the movement of this trunk uh, the the side the way the nabari is uh, how wide it is and I stripped off all the bark and uh, I put wood hardener all over it and uh, satin kind of varathane and still didn't do anything with it for a while until I took it down to another workshop and uh, Eric said, boy, that tr I love that trunk. And he says, I've got some whips, some podocarpus whips. And I so I picked up some podocarpus whips and I planted them here. I uh, dremeled out a channel all the way up, planted the podocarpus whips and tied them in with zip ties, as you can see, and held them in tightly with some uh, cardboard. And now, as you can see, they've pretty much Done, done pretty well, rooted really well in the uh, in the dirt. I've got uh, pot, just potting soil in here, not uh, bonsai soil. So I've got two podocarpus whips, one on each side, which may have been a mistake where I placed them. But uh, anyway, it's come along really well. As you can see, it's really vigorously growing. So uh, I wanted to give an update on this and uh, I kind of wish I hadn't planted it in that pot this way because this is going to be virtually impossible to get out and redo because what I've got the, uh, the trunk uh, fixed in there with is uh, it's uh, very securely tied and I think screwed in. I can't remember. It's been a while since I did it. So it's not going to leave this pot in this position very easily. But I kind of like this as the, no, is it over here? Maybe as the front, where did I do this? Okay, right about here, because you can still catch a lot of the, of the Nabari. But here from this angle, you can't see either one of the channels. It's up to the bottom, the bottom right a little bit. And uh, I'll do a little more, a little wiring, maybe pull this down and over to the side a little so you can see. Maybe you don't need to see more of the trunk, but there's enough there. That uh, this has actually become one of my favorite bonsais, and I have a whole bunch of bonsais. And this is one that I kind of did myself. I think I probably started killing it when I did all this carving. Uh, but... This is a really good example, I think, of just hanging in there with with your bonsai, even if even if you kill them, if they're if it's a really nice piece of material, you can end up making something kind of interesting out of it. So, this is a short update on my Podocarpus uh, Phoenix graft. Podocarpus uh, tanuki, 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 and uh, I don't even think I need to really style it much right now. I'm just letting it go in the Florida climate. Isn't it cool? I like it. Thanks for your uh, attention. Bye.